Flying dust and circlet. Who with a circlet is gonna go creep? So you get that pretty easily. Oh, actually, I actually think Flight already bought the first circlet. I don't know, whatever. EXP tome, high. Alright, that's cool. Uh, so yeah, Fly's doing some creeping. He got himself a bit of experience, whatevs. Who's gonna probably try to chop down this grunt right here? You know, as both players just getting ready to tech, there's Flies, who's is should be starting, there we go. Both players I believe lost their scout presence, they're both at twenty two food. And yeah, who's losing this battle at current? Actually, who couldn't have gotten a peasant kill that wasn't um Oh that's gonna be dangerous. That wasn't either denied or um or killed by a burrow because he would have leveled, so uh, I'm not sure what happened to Fly Scout Peasant. But he is minus one. Actually, no, he's not. He's at 23. He's fine. Okay. I lied. Sorry about that. Anyway, so a little skirmish in the middle. Uh, you know, who screwed up by going for the grunt so much? And you notice that as he went for the grunt, they got dropped down to the half. In the meantime, his blade mask got dropped down to almost nothing. Guess who won that fight? Alright, Fly did. The important thing is you really have to go for the blade master because I mean you can force a grunt back and you know that's fine, but uh, unless you know you're able to kill it and you have like a lot of wind blocks, you have boots or something, you know unless you know you're able to kill the grunt, don't go for the grunt because that's just a heal salve away from negating everything you just did. But you get a blade master down and he's got to be really careful because you know if he's in a bad situation you get a hero kill. He's mad f. He has to run to the shop to pick up salves. You know, with a grunt, you can leave it for a while, do some creeping, then pick up salves later. You know, there's a lot of things you can do without the grunt, but there's not a lot of things you can do without your blade master. So, Fly finally getting himself level 2, double circlet's nice. Um, who getting himself creeping as well. This time he might actually get this grunt. No, it's actually probably too high. He does salve himself, that's good. And he's gonna go and try to chop this grunt down. He's gonna do what he can. But Fly is probably going to be okay. Yeah. There is no base block this time, so he's going to be able to easily get out there. So, who going to focus as much as he can? And actually, he will get it. Chop. Oh, you unlucky bitch. He went walked a little bit too soon, and the chop did not go through. Because the thing is. As you would walk, there's a fade time. You know, there's, there's a, a time for which you don't turn invisible yet. And during that time, you can still get a swing down without breaking your wind walk. Unfortunately for him, he wind walked just a tenth of a second too soon. And the wind walk, uh, basically, the invisibility turned on before that swipe could come down. So that is unfortunate for who. He would have already been level three, but I mean, now he is. Uh, Unfortunately for who, he's only level two. <laughs> okay. But Fly's gonna go creep now. He's gonna here we go, he's gonna yeah, he gets his units in position. And yeah. So there we go. Focus on the troll warlord pretty easy. Grunt getting low, whatever. Nice drop for Fly. Who's going for his yeah, he's gonna go harass these buildings back here, so. You notice that the Shadowhunter is going to come out, and it's not going to matter. So, here we go. Come on. Come on, who? Good boy. He's going to try to chop down a Fly's Peon. There we go. There's one. Other one gets in a burrow. That's easy. We're now he's going to get Hex. I mean, this is... He really... He could have gone for Beast here, and that probably would have mattered a lot more. I think who is stupid to have gone for the Lumber, because... Well, Fly had seven guys in Lumber all game. It's kind of hard to get a lot done when that's happening. So, yeah, I guess, I mean, who's getting some experience... And you know, he might hurt his opponent's lumber. I mean, certainly he's not going to get grunt upgrade and ensnare anytime soon, but honestly, he's already got his tier 2 buildings up. He doesn't need that much lumber for a while. But here's a creep check. Let's see if he can do it. So notice that it's, it's a Shadow Hunter versus a Blade Master. You know? It's same grunt count, but it's it's Hex versus a Blade Master's right click. And guess what happens? Shadow Hunter gets right clicked. And now he finally has his Blade Master with him. But Fly has a ton of mana. So, I mean, you can try to force him backwards, and he will, in fact, and he's going to get himself his salve on. There's the salve and wind walk, and, uh, yeah. It's actually going to be very difficult for Hu to, uh, not get his 
Shit, rate. Guess what? Oh, windwalk broke. Yep, and he, he did it correctly. He windwalked just when you knew the fucking hex was gonna go on. And oh, look, your crap's still getting owned, and there's another windwalk strike. And. Guess what? Oh, peace. Hex broke and died. Yeah. So. Guess what? A blade mouse can do anything he wants. Peace, 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 peace. Focus on the SH. There's a surround. That will work for him. There's a speed scroll, and. Nope, sorry, you're bad. Both players speed scrolled, and yeah. Looks like who's gonna lose a raider and not kill a shadow hunter. And he might lose his blade master. Yeah, you lost your blade master. So this is how a, a battle ideally should go, you know? You get rid of the SH, and then you can just hex spam the blade master and kill him. And it's just your attention to how much mana you have. I mean, honestly, Fly got the kill on the Shadow Hunter because he had a bunch of Windwalks from Clarity Ink or not spamming Windwalk earlier. It, the mana just, it matters. And certainly he had very nice items, LOL double circlet for the hit points, mana, and boots of Quoth Loss for the uber damage per second output. But, uh, I mean, this is just over. You know, it's, it's all Blade Master. And it's your ability to do just some, uh, really, really unbalanced crap with a Blade Master. And yeah, I mean, what's up? I have immense DPS and a hex. You just lost everything. That's the end of the story. So, Fly rolled him in game one. K piece by. Who says GG? I would too. And there you have it. That's how to completely dominate another orc. You get yourself level three. Even if you don't get an experience totem, even if you don't get claws of attack. Even if you're getting out crept, get level three, kill a shadow hunter. That's all it takes. So yeah, very short audio. Hope you enjoy. And uh, yeah, bye.